Hello my dear family members, Accenture has been asking the advanced coding problem mainly from dynamic programming or the question is on subsequence or substring based. You know on 22nd September they asked a quite similar problem. So let's see what was that. The question is regarding you are given two integers n and k. Your task is to print smallest possible good integer. So the question is regarding good integer right. So an integer is said to be a good integer only if it's greater than k and it can be obtained by deleting zero or more than digits, more digits from n without changing the order of the remaining digits. So note that there will be always a good integer and here the input format given the input consists of a single line and the line contains two space separated integers n and k. Input will be read by stdin by the candidate. And here is the output format the print the smallest possible good integer right constraints are given follow that and here is the example input so for 7195 the value of n and the value of k is 11 the output is 5, 15 why i am explaining let's uh, at first see the second input that is for 25 and the k value is 2 and the output is 5 how i am explaining so in this number 7195 we can have many subsequence or substring like 7195 7179 75 7195 7195 195 195 right so this way we will have one such digit one such number which will be just smaller i mean just greater than 11 right so that number will be the smallest possible good integer right so in this case 1 5 is the smallest possible good integer for 11 so in the second input as well the value of n is 25 and the value of k is 2 and here the subsequence possible that is 2 5 and 25 so three possibilities right so in this case uh, one such digit or one such number is present that is greater than 2 and just greater than 2 right so that means 5 can be possible so the output is 5 right so i hope you got the logic so if you understood the problem then start solving the question by yourself if not possible then let me know i will give you the solution after 24 hours okay let's see who can give the answer at the first so thank you for today's session